Okay, everybody. Um, and here are the micro SD cards that I uh, am recommending you. I'm trying to make this video under five minutes. Cause I recorded and it was ten minutes and it was too long. Anyway, as you can see with these benchmark tests for other smartphones done via the Samsung Galaxy Note 4 and the app A1 SD Bench app, these are the uh, top rated micro SD cards for the Quintra Read. You can see them right here. I'm not going to say them to you because it's going to take too long about the speeds that they have. But the top performers are Sandisk Extreme Plus, the Lexar 6. 33x uh the transit ultimate 600x um and then you see the rest of them for the sequential right uh the top performers are trans uh, the kingston uh micro sd 64 gigabyte the transit ultimate 600x uh samsung pro micro sd the sand disk extreme plus etc etc then you see the lexar 633x which is about the third fourth fifth six six micro sd card Okay, so I recommend the Sandus Extreme Pro because obviously if the Plus is doing pretty good, it's in the, that's not where I want to look, it's in the um, the top rating for the sequential read speed, so whatever, then the Pro is going to do much better. Um, and for the sequential write, um, I recommend the, I mean, I, oh my god, I'm messing up. Okay, so, and then you see the Transit Ultimate 600X or whatever. Um it performed really well in the sequential read speeds and it did really well in the uh, sequential write speed. So there's actually another one, an upgraded version of Transit Ultimate 633X. So if that performed well, then obviously then that version will perform even better. So I recommend those two and I'm actually going to show you the pages of those. And Alexar did very well in the sequential read speeds. It got um, about 67 megabytes per second and then it did really well in the sequential write speeds it got about 25.92 uh, 25.92 megabytes per second and there is actually an upgraded version of that so i recommend those three upgraded versions um for the 64 gigabytes i actually have a link that i'm going to put on the video for my amazon list of micro sd cards i recommend the transit ultimate 633x 64 gigabyte micro SD card. Um, it's a UHS one U3 uh, class or whatever. I don't want to say too much if it's going to take too long. And then a Sandus Extreme Pro. Um, that one, this transient right here. I'm actually actually already have the page right here, but um, that's not the page for the Transit Ultimate 633X. The sequential read speeds or the read speeds are 95 megabytes per sec per second. That's is up to that speed, and for the write is up to 85 megabytes per second. For the Sandus Extreme Pro, that one is up to 95 megabytes per second read speed, and it's up to 90 megabytes per second write speed. And I only recommend for the uh, 128 gigabyte micro SD card, the Lexar 128 gigabyte professional UHS 2 micro SD card, because it's actually backwards compatible if you look on Lexar's website. So it performs up to the top speeds of UHS 1. If it, your your smartphone does not support UHS 2 micro SD cards, it performs the top speeds for the UHS 1. And then if it doesn't support UHS 1, it performs the top speeds for the uh, class 10 uh, speed class for micro SD cards. So I recommend that. It's actually not out now. It's only available for pre-order. I think it releases around July. It's actually cheaper than what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be about $180, but you can get it from B&H Photo for about $150, well, cheaper than that, $148.19. Um, and it comes with free expedited shipping um, on there. And you can actually get it for Adorama.com for the same price, and it actually has another uh, free expedited shipping for one to three days. Um, on those website and if I'm not mistaken they both support PayPal um, for the payment use or whatever and you can also use Google Wallet on both of them I actually went to Adorama and I actually went to the checkout stage and I remember seeing Google Wallet and if I'm not mistaken a b &H photo has that too so and they both come with free expedited shipping so I would get that one because it is obviously a good speed class or whatever and if your smartphone does not uh, support UHS 2. It supports UHS 1 with backwards compatibility and class uh, 10 for backwards compatibility. Um, the Transin uh, 633X 64 gigabyte micro SD card is available on Amazon Prime for $65.99. It comes with free Amazon Prime two-day shipping. So I would recommend you to get it from there. Um, it actually used to be, if you can see, $78.99. And the SanDisk Extreme Pro 64 gigabyte micro SD card. Actually, I wanted to do this video yesterday, but stuff happened or whatever. And it was actually on sale for about $60. 
but it's still a great performing micro SD card. And right now, I'm sorry, unfortunately, it's back up to about $88.99, but it still is a great performing micro SD card and it comes with free Amazon Prime two day shipping. So those are the micro SD cards that I uh, recommend to you and I'm actually going to link you to all of those micro 